Hey guys, it's me Angga Rizky. So welcome back to my video. And in this video, it will be the first video for design and also implement it into Xcode with the uh, for the iOS application. And of course, we will start it from the splash screen because it's easy and simple for getting start okay well i have prepared the uh, the sketch app and create new document and then i will choose it for uh, artboard and iphone se because we will working with the iphone se and i will get the splash screen here okay and then let's try to make the background because we need the background and change to BG app you can see BG app and I want to use the uh, purple color like this okay and then we need the logo so i will use the text here the name of application is ara ara is my sister and i love her and i will use this typeface for the uh, time no maybe I i'm looking for a good phone Okay, I think it's good, but I'm um, I cancel to use the purple. Maybe I prefer like to blue. Okay, and then I want to make the uh, the oval here and remove and change the field color to the white. And of course, it's it is my logo like this. And then we can setting this white. I want to make to zero. I make the make make it one the spacing. Okay. So this is the logo for our app and then we just need to create the round dot for the button here okay and get the margin button is uh, 35 And I want to change this button color to the green. This is a BG button. And then we need the text here. Get start. Okay. And change it to the uh, SF. No, we don't have SF. So I will use the robot. So and change the font size to 20 and change the weight is medium like this and we need the color I will change it the color to the black and of course we will group it for the started BTN because it's button so I call it uh, BTN okay and then we need the text here this is the text for the uh, it's only banner okay 
okay and I will place it into uh, above the button and around 7, 70 for the margin okay so this is logo and this is the uh, like a caption we can group it for the caption and this is for the button it's simple uh, wait I don't like this we just need to take this maybe it's cool okay well we have the logo and caption and button so we just need to select all of them and make exportable and select to three multiplication and the format is PNG and export layer and go to desktop and create new folder for the assets and then we can export and I want to check it first BG app caption and logo and start button okay so we're going to Xcode for iOS and create new Xcode project and in the tab you can see the iOS here and choose the single view application and get the splash screen next and I want to place it into my desktop and create new directory so we're ready for the splash screen and choose the assets here you can see the assets just click here and then we can go to splash screen sorry we can go to the assets and drag all of them okay and after that we go to mine.storyboard and this is our mockup it could be right here so I will change it to iPhone SE like this okay the first thing we need to create is a background so you can see here you can find another uh, component like a image view like a text view or text view or anything else so I will use this for the image view and we can drag to the corner and make it full and after that we need to get the background so I will use this for the BGF like this and go to this rule and make it responsive like this and then you can see in the view we have the content mode so I will get it for the expect fit like this so we're going to see the mock-up again so we need the logo here so I will use the image view again and the uh, image is a uh, logo and we can setting the content map to aspect fit and you can see the role here and we can see the size is 117 and 20 but I think it's too small So maybe we need to resize okay and make to center and you can press the control and click to the view and center horizontal container okay so I wanna preview it first into my emulator so we will use the iPhone SE and play and 
we have problem here it's too big uh, maybe we will click here to fix something okay okay and we can uh, stop it and play again and we can see the result just see what's happening yeah it's cool right tada <laughs> well we need something here again for the button so we click here and check for the button and drag here and then we can also setting the width is 250 and the height is 551 so 250 and the height is uh, like this okay and we can make to center and the margin bottom is uh, 35 so we need the background so we can click here and the background is a uh, stop button like this and you can you don't need the default title okay and then we can press the control and we can go to view and center horizontal like this and we can press it and add missing constraint like this okay no auto layout issue so after that we need the caption so we can use the image view here right here and then go to the image for the caption and the content mode is aspect fit and we can see the size width is 172 by multiplication 90 we can go to roll 172 and the height is 90 and we can get the margin top is 40 okay we can select this and go to view and center uh, no 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 we don't need the center so cancel so we can stop the emulator and play again to see the final result tada this is our first plus screen and I love it we have the button caption and this is for the logo app so I hope it's uh, work for you because it's simple and also don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel Angga Rizky and nice to meet you from Indonesia so see you the next video tutorial goodbye